Welcome. This is the energy vibration mm -hmm. reading for the Aries Sun Moon Horizon sign. This is the second week of October. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful support, likes, and shares. Please remember to listen to the Sun Moon Horizon sign. And I want to say to each and every person, thank you for returning and um, being here. Okay, let's look and see what's coming in for you guys, you Aries. Please remember to listen to the moon reading and like shares and share these videos so what's coming in for the Aries in this week the energy of the moon is here and I just said the moon reading okay whatever is happening to you um, Aries you guys are the second ones who are getting the moon the emotion okay the moon is the balance of emotions okay let's put it like that the moon is the balance of your emotions some of you are going to be having some emotional situation with your relationship whatever that is it's going to be working out there is the energy of luck coming up for you guys so let's go in the week the week begins from the 8th until the 14 energy of the week is a fire sign so this is wonderful for you guys zodiac energy is air let's see what's coming up for Monday um you have uh, the nine of cups so your wishes and dreams are going to be happening um, for you Aries and it has to do with money so on Monday you're going to be happy because your wishes and dreams about money is coming out um, you have a situation with a past life situation with family the energy of the eight of Pentacles is here so some of you are going to be working out a situation um, and this is what I said about the energy of uh, your relationship so it could be with your partner so we're calling out the angels and guides to show us the energy for the a weekend for um the aries and moon horizon sign for the weekend we have um the king of swords coming in um and you have um the house or work or and you have uh, um, the energy of you connecting with others the ten of ones is here some of you have some emotional situations that you have to deal with energy of the ten of ones is there with some emotional situations so on Monday it's going to be um, a very positive Tuesday is a new start to your financial situation if you have been having some financial situation um, Wednesday as a three of cups that uh, money coming in you're okay you're you're working hard on a wet, uh, Thursday Friday you have the energy for um, the king of um, swords some of you could be having a relationship with this person some of you could be connecting with this person this person could be helping you out financially um, the energy of the four of ones is here so there is going to be stability if you're looking for a new house um, um, that is going to be available you're going to be working together with others um, to um, find a new place um, the three of cups and the three of Pentacles is here so it's going to be actually a wonderful week for you guys the number 33 energies is here up in this week so some of you are going to be happy about the situation with the king of swords whoever this king of swords is whether he's your partner um, in love or in marriage or in work um, he's going to be helping you with a new start okay some of you are going to be having some um, 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 new start in your financial situation and you're going to be happy some celebrations okay so some of you could be moving to a new house finding a new house um, I'm seeing the burden of getting all of this uh, cleared up and things going but I see that you're working together with others to bring um, the stability in so let's see what is it with the nine of cups and the king of swords um, he could be paying you some money okay you could be receiving message um, that um, money is coming in from the king of swords so you could sell um, <clears throat> and I don't know why I'm receiving this information that you sold out someone to receive this money and you're you you receive the message um <laughs> okay so you did oh my god and this is exactly how it fell out 
Oh my God. Okay. You know, whoever you are, it's not nice what you did and it's going to come back to you. Okay. It's not nice. So some of you have sold out someone to receive some money and <clears throat> this is not going to last because whatever the money the money is not gonna last okay that's bad what you did I'm seeing some of you ladies planning I'm seeing some of you ladies really sitting down thinking and planning your way forward I'm really seeing some of you ladies sitting down and planning your way forward whatever that is happening whatever plan that is happening and whatever situation that is happening I'm seeing some of you planning your way out some of you are deciding that um, whatever the situation you had with this king of swords whether he was your partner or your business partner or that sort of a thing um, you're deciding to leave the situation behind okay whatever the situation is you're deciding to leave it behind because obviously there has been um, a situation where you feel as if you have done something of injustice a lot of you are deciding to walk away and leave this burden behind some of you are feeling uh, having some regrets that you did something some of you are really having some regrets that you did something whatever you have done um, you have some regrets that you did something whoever you are out there be aware of what you give out whatever you did to someone else because it's a family member that you have done it to some of you sold out someone to have some balance for the rest of it is good I'm seeing really positive energies some of you um, have win a lawsuit and your wishes and dream is coming out and you're going to be receiving some money some stability is here for you guys um, someone tried to do something very deceptive okay and uh, you needed to get out of a burden so you did something deceptive but it's gonna come back to you because you're feeling bad about what you did and there is a transition that is coming up but not to worry let's look at the positive side of this week which is um very wonderful i'm seeing wonderful positive situation and energies that is coming in for you guys a lot of you ladies are planning your future you're trying to release yourself of a burden that you're going through it can be emotional burden that you have been carrying and you're trying to release yourself of this emotional burden and you're going to be doing that in this week I'm seeing help coming in for you guys I'm seeing a lot of people I'm um, going to be connecting with work and this is going to be in a very positive way so um, whatever the situation is whatever that has been transpiring in your life you're going to be receiving positive energies and positive situations coming out some of you are really deciding because um, the whole aspect of the week is actually your emotional burden that you have been carrying you're going to decide to leave this emotional burden behind you and as we see we have the energy of um, the the some of you could be winning a lawsuit um, something that was um, stolen could be returning to you and you're deciding to make a plan of how you're going to be using um, the resources that is coming into you how you're going to be using it and make sure that you doesn't waste it so some luck some luck is coming in here for some of you some of you are going to be really um, receiving um, some luck it's not going to stay long it's just quick luck coming in for you guys okay let's see um, what the energies of um, the um, the unicorns are saying for the um, Aries people and remember this is a general reading I'm seeing a lot of energies with uh, um, solutions um, happiness joy people are connecting with each other people are bringing strong foundations celebrations is happening um, the weekend is going to be good because you have uh, the four of Pentacles I'm seeing a lot of celebrations people coming together and working together let's see what is coming out um, the light okay 
so what is happening in this week is that you have to see the light within each and every person okay sometimes you you um, dislike people for whatever reason it is and you have to see the light within each and every person because each and every person carries a light just as you carry um, positive and negative polarities so does each and every person on this planet because as we come in on this planet we all vibrate with these negative and positive polarities and this is what is going to be happening in this um, week for you guys so see the light in and it says see the light within yourself and everyone else so whatever that is transpiring um, whatever you do you know this will come back so whatever however you try to be positive in this week try and um, bring in positive energies and see um, everyone with pure light um, because if we don't we're vibrating in that negative secrets of seeing people just um, using their egos and that's what we're trying to do whatever your burden is your emotional burden because of your season emotional burdens you're going to be letting this go and moving forward okay so I want to say to you guys this is going to be um, um, a week of uh, you have to deal with your inner demons I'm seeing some of you really sit down and thinking and dealing with your own inner demons whatever the situation is whatever that has transpired you're sitting down and dealing with your own inner demons and you're coming out of this situation so ladies and gentlemen I want to say to you guys thank you for being here please go and listen this is a general reading for the week there are more information if you um, choose to go and listen to the moon energy vibration reading the on-demand is just a cup of coffee okay the on-demand it's not expensive it's just a coffee with the energy vibration of the moon it's gonna help you with these two first weeks in the month of uh, October so go back and listen to the energy vibration of the moon reading for September which there are information that is going to be connecting you you need to go and look at the fire energy vibration for the moon in the month of September the fire sign the fire zodiac sign I want to say thank you for being here namaste until next time yeah.